The Niger Delta Development Commission was established in 2000 with the aim of facilitating the rapid, even and sustainable development of the Niger Delta region. 19 years after, questions have been raised as to how effectively the commission has discharged its mandate. There are tales of abandoned projects, poor construction and allegation of corruption. No doubt, billions of Naira has gone to NDDC as a location over the years. So when a delegation of South-South leaders visited President Muhammadu Buhari, he told them that work and ground does not match funds released to NDDC. I mean, you just can't say you spend so many billions and then when you go, it's only the lagoon you see. And so you don't, you don't see the structures that are claimed to have been done. Uh, uh, they also use consultants. So the consultants must prove to be they were competent. And uh, not like what the Minister of Niger Delta said, that uh, they will just put asphalt on top of brown mud and then when the rain comes, it carries it away. He then wields the big stick. We are putting so much money, especially the NDDC. Um, we have asked for a forensic uh, audit of, of, of what has been happening because uh, the amount of money which the federal government is religiously allocating to NDDC, we'd like to see the results on the ground. And uh, those that are responsible for that, I think, will eventually be asked to explain certain issues. The president said projects done must be verifiable, but hints that he will wait for the audit report before he decides the next line of action. Only weeks ago, the House of Representatives threatened a zero allocation to the NDDC unless it pays up about one trillion naira it owed contractors. Now, the Senate is also not happy. It has commenced investigation into a 2.5 billion naira contract for water hyacinth, allegedly jacked up to 65 billion naira. We have invited the NDDC, Acting Managing Director and Management, to come and you know, testify before this committee, Committee of the Senate on Public Accounts, on an issue that has become of national importance. That is the award of contracts that I will do with the clearing of water high strength in the Niger Delta region. And then, of course, the deceiving contracts that were awarded by NDDC under the emergency you know, program. But back at the State House, Governor Syriaki Dixon of Bielsa spoke on behalf of the group, calling for the repositioning of the NDDC, amongst other issues. So, more or less, we had. A meeting of minds, we compared notes and all agreed on what the challenges that we all need to work together to address. So that's um, a good thing for the Niger Delta. On the forthcoming election in the state, Mr. Dixon calls for peaceful and credible election. From the presidential villa Abuja, Ibrahim Adra, Channels Television News.